Welcome to our channel. In this session, we are going to discuss about NP hard and NP complete. Before that, you need to know what is a P class problem and what is NP class problem. P class means the set of decision problems that can be solvable by a deterministic Turing machine in polynomial time or called P class problems. Now, a set of decision problems that can be solvable by a non-deterministic Turing machine in polynomial time are called NP class problems. Generally, it is very hard to find out the solution to the NP class problem. Why? The solutions are find out by using non-deterministic Turing machine. Suppose, once we find out the solution, it is very easy to verify the solution. Why? The solutions are verified by using deterministic Turing machine. Okay. Now you know what is P class problem, what is NP class problem. Now these NP class problem have two categories. One is NP hard and another one is NP complete. First, I am moving into NP hard problem. Now, I will give you one problem A. Assume A is a problem. Generally, how do we find out the solution? One scenario is, if a problem is given, the problem is reducible to some another problem. The problem is reducible to another problem. And we are find out the solution to this problem. We are find out the solution to this problem. Now, by using this solution, we will construct the solution to the problem A. This is one type of scenario for find out the solution to A. Now, why this logic is for NP hard? See this one. A problem is... A problem is NP hard. How when you say that a problem is NP hard? If if all the problems, if all the problems of NP class are polynomial reducible, polynomial time reducible to now you think you understand? Okay, no problem. I will explain one more time. For example, for every problem, for every problem, L belongs to NP. That means NP consists of subset of problems. Assume L is called as all the problems. For every problem, L belongs to NP. The problem is reducible to the problem is reducible to A. The problem is reducible to A. Here that A is called NP hard problem. You got a simple thing. For every problems in NP class, if the problems are reducible to another problem, then these problems are called NP hard problem. Basically, all NP hard problems are not NP problems. Think you understand? This is NP hard problem. Halting problem. So everything, more of the examples, any of the Hamiltonian cycle, traveling salesperson problem, all those are NP hard problem. This is the definition. Now move to NP complete problem. NP complete problem. Simply, a problem is NP complete if it is both NP problem and NP hard problem. Simple. You know that one. What is NP problem? A problem that is solvable by non-deterministic Turing machine in polynomial time are called NP problem. What is NP hard problem? For every problem, a problem in NP class, 
is polynomial time reducible to another problem. Such problems are called NP hard. Suppose if a problem is both NP hard and NP, such problems are called NP complete problem. Satisfiability problem SAT is a NP complete problem. Generally, draw the Venn diagram, you will understand. Suppose this is P class problem. Assume this is NP class problem. And this one is NP hard problem. And what is this common? NP complete problem. Now understand this one. So, P is a subset. This entire Venn diagram circle is NP class problem. Within that NP, some problems are P class problems. So, generally P subset are equal to NP. Now, all NP hard problems are not NP. Yes or no? Only this particular part are NP. NP hard some other problems are there. Any problem that is both NP and NP hard. That is called NP complete problem. These are four types of problems. P class, NP class, NP hard and NP complete. Okay. Thank you very much.